السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته معاكم يوسف من قناة Righteous Progress إن شاء الله اليوم نكمل شابتر 11 و 12 وإن شاء الله أقدر أحطهم في فيديو واحد الحين نكمل من آخر مرة وصلنا لها وطقيت ستارت لحظة سخير طفي الزقارة عشان نبدي الأكشن يلا نقول بسم الله روح بلو تريفا بالضبط هي شكرا في شيء لا والله ما في شيء I was still in danger looked like soldiers in one of those Central American guerrilla armies. Pirates with a manifesto. Psychos with a dream. That sort of bullshit. Zen, I'm sorry. Drugs, coke, pills. You could get whatever party favor you wanted on this vessel. <clears throat> طبعا اللي ما يعرف اللعبة ناس على الاكس بوكس 360 بلاي ستيشن 3 وعلى البي سي انا قاعد العبها على البي سي وحاطها على افضل الاعدادات حق الجرافيكس كارت انفيديا جي تي اكس 780 على ما اعتقد ميبي اي كود سند اوت ان اس او اس حلو لا احنا ردينا شوي Certainly wasn't the first time I'd woken up with a hangover long after a party had turned sour. يعني الحين صار لك معاهم خمس سنين. ما تعلمت لغتهم. حلو حلو كاكا. طبعا تشوفون. الماشين كان مالي لونه ذهبي يلمع لاني سويت له ابجريد راجعوا فيديو فيديوهاتي اللي قبل عشان تشوفون وين اماكن الابجريد يصير استراح حيل قوي يعني ما تستعمل غيره need to get out of the boat's hull and onto the upper deck as soon as possible was countered by the probability of running into another hijacker. I had to move carefully. Mahad carefully. The fire was sucking oxygen from the room. I didn't care if I got shot the second I got out of there. I needed one more gulp of fresh air before I died. 
It was like the need for a wake-up whiskey after a two-day bender. How to shut off the fuel feeds. Move, Max. I shut down one engine, but it didn't make much difference. Smelling like suntan oil, stale margaritas, and greed. This was the famous Panama Canal. We could have gone to the moon while I was passed out and I wouldn't have noticed. TJ While I'd been dead to the world, some of my shipmates were just plain <coughs> dead. Where had they taken them? Where? I'm not going to It was a different scene than the one I'd stumbled away from. Where was everyone? I still didn't know what the hell happened. هذه الابجريد تكون محطوطين بمكان مو حيل مخشوش لا يعني تقدر تلقاه باللعب الطبيعي اللي يدور كل منطقه يدشها لا Guys up ahead weren't dealing with passengers like the rest of them. Maybe I should have realized then that this was no ordinary kidnap job. Something on the boat had attracted the sharks. واحد يذبح لا السلاح سهل اللعبة حيل whatever they were looking for appeared to be gone There was something firing these guys other than good old fashioned socialist zeal. What were they looking for? Sir, 
يتبعون عن شنو يعني؟ It didn't make sense. Why would they leave the jewels and rip open the walls? It didn't occur to me just what the other cargo on board could be. I was on a ghost ship in a ghost canal. The whole thing creeped me the hell out. They didn't help with my sea legs, but they sure as shit felt good. And the band played on. Yeah, something on the bridge. I checked every other inch of the boat. I 
spotted Passos and Marcella. If I'd known back then that they'd been up to no good while I was fighting my way through a band of violent paramilitaries and a worse hangover, I might not have wanted to get over to them so bad. Hey, Passos! At the time, I hadn't thought too much about this. I hadn't thought too much about anything. Now I remember it, it didn't seem quite so kosher. What about, what's her name? Daphne. Uh, do whatever you think is best. I think it's best we try to go find her. Yeah, okay, let's go. Yeah. See, I didn't think Passos was a bad guy. He didn't need to try to save this woman or the crew. We're here. and bullshit artists, I'd been the cabaret act. Shooting whatever came in front of me was easier than coming to terms with that reality. I'll show
مو مخشوش شي ان مية بالمية بس يعني ما تشوفهم اذا مستعير my back I'd get a bullet in it I blocked out all my questions all I thought about was getting to Daphne Bernstein before it was too late. Oh. Jesus Christ. Much <laughs> Would be like this. <laughs> I should have jumped in that goddamn canal myself and swum my way back to New York. Like Daphne Bernstein, something about an unpleasant divorce. Her ex-husband worked on Wall Street. Do you think he has easy access to Panamanian death squads? Guess I didn't really think about it. You were smuggling something, weren't you? No, no, no. I mean, I didn't realize it at the time. I, I didn't think too much about it, but yes, Marcelo did drive off with something. I don't know what. I didn't see him until we got to Brazil a week or so later. I think it was money. I think Marcelo and Victor... <laughs> friendly banker there in Panama. Your little cruise was to deliver the cash to him because there it's easier to launder. I thought the Broncos were rich. 
How do he go rich? The other two, they live well, but they don't have real money. Victor's campaigns were always financed by his brother. That is the way among certain rich families there. The eldest brother is the king. You know, he gets everything. The other two, not so much. And now Rodrigo's dead. Exactly. In Marcelo, too. It's an awful tragedy for Victor, huh? A man running on a law and order ticket, you know, whose brothers have both been killed in such terrible circumstances. A true patriot. What about Marcelo? Marcelo. Marcelo was an idiot. For this true, I certainly don't believe he could possibly have known about it. But I do believe some other scheme, you know, some other bullshit. Whatever that cash was, Victor could have talked him into something. I don't know. Yet. And Passos? Well, Passos is a bum ex-cop. Failed in America. Failed in Sao Paulo. He was surrounded by more money and more poverty than his tiny little head can handle. You think guys like that can't be bought? No, but if... But nothing. Probably not a bad guy. He's just a man caught in the crossfire of a very rich family. What about me? You. You're the fall guy. The American. Running around, acting like the action hero. Killing lots of people. <laughs> You're a stroke of genius. That ain't how it is. You were an angry ex-cop. You were sitting in a bar with a history of violence and a history of a bad temper. You were perfect. Me and Passos went to the academy together. Did you? I don't fucking know. <clears throat> okay, let's take a drive, Max. Wanna do some good? Hmm? Wanna get yourself killed in a good cause? And I need you to check something out for me. Like what? That incident at the favela today. Now, some of my officers say a bus drove off some captives. They did, I saw it. But no captives were ever booked. They probably handed them off to the paramilitary death squads, the, uh... Casa Preta? Right. Who did? I don't know, the cops. The other cops, the cops who shoot on sight. The Ufe. Right. Max, you see that building there? The Imperial Palace Hotel? Yeah, that's what it says. People go in there, in large groups, under armed guard. But it isn't a police station, and no one comes out of there. Why don't you just go in and bust the joint, get a warrant? I'm only a cop, Max. <laughs> so you keep saying. <clears throat> Time to find out what was going on here. I didn't fancy booking myself in the presidential suite, so went looking for the basement. I wasn't too excited about the acoustics in this place. A couple of gunshots would sound like I'd walked in here with a goddamn marching band. It wasn't pretty, but I guess none of what was about to happen was gonna be. It was the question I kept on asking myself. How could I have been so blind? I was convinced the Broncos had gotten the wrong man for the job, but maybe De Silva was right. I was the stooge. The bad joke everybody got but me. Either those guys wheeled their trash out on stretchers, or something was seriously wrong here. When you 
you find yourself in hell, dance with the devil. The Imperial Palace Hotel was a five-star bona fide shithole. I needed to find out why guests were checking in by the busload and checking out by the bag load. Maybe the service would be better upstairs. يلا اطلع Shift upgrade this out. Here you go. Sniper. I had Jimobi sniper. Why not? 